primarily deal with blockages in arteries, sometimes in veins. And obviously blood flow is essential to health and to life and for things functioning properly. Uh, part of our job is to identify where blockages are and what kind of problems they're causing and to correct those blockages. This is our new Siemens RT Zigo C-Arm. It's a specialized machine that helps us to x-ray during procedures. If you can't see a problem, you can't fix it. I would explain the difference as our old machine was like having a standard definition television and our new machine is like having a high definition television. And over time, medical technology progresses just as it does in every other field. Well, this machine has an arm that moves and rotates and is able to stretch forward and to retract, whereas our old machine could only turn in about four dimensions. Having the ability to reach all the way from the patient's head all the way down to their foot is really a big advancement in terms of what we're able to do. Not only that, with the amount of detail, because we have a much larger screen that has a much higher resolution, we're going to be able to see the little details, the small things more clearly so that you can treat it more precisely. If you think about it, it's the difference between having something that just moves like this sideways and versus something that can turn and articulate in just about any direction. One of the advancements of this machine is that in the past, we would take one picture, then you turn to the the C-arm as we call it, the x-ray machine, and take another picture. So each picture that you took was a two-dimensional picture. Now with this machine, we can inject the dye into the blood vessel and the machine will spin and create a three-dimensional image that you can then follow. And if you can't see something front to back, then you can turn the machine and the three-dimensional image will change with that so you can follow it. it. Gives you a roadmap that you can follow that you weren't able to follow before. I think this is a fantastic investment. I, you know, I think it's great that the hospital has taken the time and you know, money to invest in something like this for the future of the hospital and especially for the patients that are in our community.